Hi there, it's Lucas with Camo, and I'm here to answer the question of how to get multiple audio sources into your Camo Studio for iPad recording or stream, even though the audio tab seems to have only one option for an audio input. Now, the reason for that has to do with the current limitations of the iPad's operating system, but happily, it doesn't mean you can't easily get two or even more audio sources into your video. In fact, there's a couple of ways that you can do it. So, if you create or stream content that requires multiple audio sources, maybe you're a gamer who needs to get your commentary along with your gameplay, maybe you're a musician who needs to mic both your instrument and your voice, or perhaps you're a podcaster who needs to capture both sides of the conversation, listen up, I'm here to show you exactly how it's done. Now, the first option is to use an audio interface like this one, one that has at least two inputs and can combine the audio from your microphone with the audio from your secondary video source, like a laptop or a video game console. All you need to do is plug your microphone into one port or socket and an audio cable from your video source into the other. To do that, you may need a cable like this or an adapter. You'll just connect one end to the headphone port of your laptop or video game console and the other into the interface. Once they're both plugged in, you can adjust the sound levels on your interface and then select it as your audio source. Now, if you hear a buzzing or a humming sound when you're monitoring the sound from your video source, it's likely a bit of interference is creeping in. Most of the time, this can be cleared up with something called a ground loop isolator that looks like this, and it simply slots into the setup between the device and your audio interface. And now for the second option. It's a good one if you're looking for something that's a bit more portable, and after all, mobility is one of the factors that makes making video on an iPad so great. Now, instead of using an audio interface, what you would need is a wireless microphone system like this one from DJI. There's a few other options out there, something like Wireless Go or newer CM28. The main thing is that the setup needs to consist of a receiver and at least two transmitters, and that at least one of the microphones should have an audio jack like this one. It's normally something you'd plug a lavalier mic into. Now here's what the setup looks like. I've connected my iPad to a powered USB hub and opened Camo Studio for iPad. I've also inserted my switch in its dock, plugged it into power, and have an HDMI cable connecting it to a capture card that's then plugged into the hub. Now I'll take my two wireless microphones, attach the first to myself to capture my voice, while connecting the second to the switch's headphone jack using a 3.5mm TRS audio cable. Finally, I'll connect the receiver to the hub and select it as my audio source. And now I'm ready to stream or record multi-source audio anywhere, without a computer or an audio interface.